Hello everybody and welcome to Two Point Hospital. I'm Stranky and um, this is the successor after 20 odd years to Theme Hospital, a game that I briefly featured at the start of my YouTube channel. Um, yeah, it's something I always wanted to get back into but um, now this has come along and uh, we're going to get into this. So uh, we start off, we don't have much of a choice, um, I think you can actually go to, no it's locked. So we'll start off here at Hogsport, um, begin your career as a hospital administrator, learn the basics of the job by establishing your first hospital. So I think the first hospital will pretty much be the tutorial hospital, much like in uh, Theme Hospital. It looks similar layout. Um, welcome to Two Point County. You are are you ready to start building your first hospital and curse cursing some pages? <laughs> I'm not that good at reading. Uh, first things first, you'll probably want to have a look around to move around hospital. Hold the right mouse button and drag. Which doesn't work right now. Move the cursor to the edges of the screen. Use WASD keys, but nothing's working. I think what we have to do is this. So zoom in, zoom out, go around, drag. Okay, now it works. First thing hospital will need is reception. Yeah. Okay, let's re build a reception desk. So do we press uh, rotate? Hold the left mouse button. we do the desk I think pretty much as they come in let's put it down is it centered no no it's centered okay so we need to hire an assistant Do you actually want a villain as a receptionist? Hmm. Great, before we officially open we need the GP's office. Yeah. Okay, so we go to rooms, GP's office, and three by three. This is the layout. Oh, that's four by three. have a slightly bigger room. we do it. So, um, in the old days you could place a chair close. Um, I'll do it like that. So at least I just come in the door and straight on the chair. They don't have to walk too much. Uh, This is Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. This is Ricky Hawthorne bringing Ricky Hawthorne. talk, music, and it's news to the whole of Two Point County. And if you're listening to us from the newly opened hospital, just turn up that volume because nothing drowns out the sound of sick people. Ricky Hawthorne was way too loud. DJ. Um, Coming up next, what we could do is I'll actually put everything a bit quieter with him much quieter um, or what we could do uh, 
lower everything and put him slightly up. Yeah, because he was uh, over speaking on top of me. So, we have to stop that again. Okay, no problem. So, we'll do the same. That, the desk. There. That there. What else do we have? Um, I think we should have a fire extinguisher. It'll do for now, just the basic room. Get it up and done with. Doctor Who. Um. Hmm, who shall we hire? Should we get Sophie? Hang on, what's treatment? Treatment. Uh, diagnostic. We'll get you if you're in diagnostics. You are the most expensive. Okay, we're open now. So what do we do now? Assuming a rotating wheel. Yeah, we've already found out how to do that. It's quite intuitive. Um, rotate the camera. Okay, pitch the camera. Ooh, okay. Diagnose patient. Someone's gonna come in. goes um we could with some like benches and stuff probably can we see what she's doing there okay she's 100% diagnosed already um we have a message pharmacy required get patient to wait okay uh can we pause while we Build a pharmacy. See, we can put the pharmacy here, but I think we'll want another GP's office at some point there. So we could have the pharmacy here as a 3x3. Three three. We'll put the door next to that one. Uh, we'll get you as close as possible again to um, minimize walking. Uh, fire extinguisher should probably help. Now, is there anything that actually helps? Uh, we need to unlock that. 400, K400. Okay, K10. So we have to earn K, K money. Alright, we'll build the room. There we go, that's done. Um, and we need to hire a nurse. So we've got Amelia, De La Grotte, Claire Bright, and Ava Shirt Dress. That's a good name. Um, you're good at treatment, but you're much better at treatment. But you're cheap. That name, Ava. But you're really good. Um, emotional happiness, bedside man. You'd be good in a ward, really. Um, hmm. Let's get the best people for now. Alright. And we'll progress time. Now everything we need to diagnose, cure a simple illness. Let's see if your new staff are up to the task. Cheapest ones. What was she doing? In the old one, this was just like a medicine cabinet. She would mix the potions and give it to them. But now it's, it actually mixes them itself. Okay, someone else is coming in to see the doctor. Doctor, doctor. Okay, we've got five grand for that. Okay, uh, well done, Kuda first patient. Uh, we've earned some money and the hospital's reputation has improved when a doctor or nurse treats a patient. Their ability, their ability will influence the chance of success. Uh, yeah, some are harder than others. 
so we need to keep on, keep on coming in. So we've cured a very first patient, so what's up with you? We've got another letter. No, he's going for cure. Okay. Janitors and maintenance. Oh yeah, we should hire a janitor. Uh, again, should we get the best one? Angus Grot. to prepare, so let's um, keeping people happy, yes that's what I was thinking, thirsty and hungry over time, access to food drinks, comfy seat, yeah that's what I was thinking, so let's see, what can we do here ok, you can go like that so that's Drink. Some can do a snack machine. Kind of there. Um, I guess we will want a bin nearby. I guess they can still get to the thing either. Um, all right, let's put some benches down. One, two. I mean, I guess we could rotate benches and have a few lined up, but uh, I don't think we'll really do that. Let's get some plants, improve the the aesthetics around here, something like that. Um, could always do some there as well, so it looks much nicer around here. Uh, can't fit one between the rooms, that's okay. That'll do for now. So, oh, we need a leaflet stand. Reminded not to in yeah, we could put one there. So, as you come in, doesn't exactly need to be symmetrical, but yeah, people can come and take a leaflet. Would you like um, breast enhancement as well as curing your disease? I don't think there's like, stuff like that. So we need a staff room now. Um, I think we'll continue on this side. So we could ideally we'll have to start thinking like where hallways and stuff would go. Um, but I think that would make a decent staff room. Um, sofa. Yeah, we can put some lockers in. Mm, should we do them up against this wall? Have to get used to that rotating. One, two, come on, close. Three, four. Okay, we can get five lockers in. Um, give them an armchair. To look a bit more like, um, yeah, something like that. They'll want a drinks machine, snack machine as well. So, one, two, give them a bin, uh, fire extinguisher, maybe it's a good idea. And a plant, could we get a pl oh. Have a snack, we'll be right back. Yeah. Hmm, that would have been a nice area for a plant there. Uh, well, hang on, if we... Move that slightly, yes we can, okay. Something like that. Do we have any tables or anything? Um, mm -hmm. We have to unlock all these things. We only have oh, we have thirty of that now. So as we do things, we get we get K money. All right. Um, but I did want something else. We'll have to see. Uh, that that will do for now. Basic room. And um, yeah. 
All right, that'll do. Seven grand on a, on a staff room. Staff will head to the staff room when they're on a break, fill the room with interesting items to help them become fully refreshed before the break ends. You can place a member of staff in the staff room to make them take a break or work. Okay, basically, yeah. Um, Alright, so. We have more. Charlie work. Um, we do have bins. Okay, we've got two bins. Yeah, we have two bins. Uh, pff, toilets. Yeah. Toilets would be quite important. Uh, what we can do is then. So, so if we were to keep three by three, are we in line? It doesn't quite look in line, but I think it is. We'll do that like that. Now we can put three toilets down. I don't think there's a male or female toilet here. Uh, sink. I don't want to go there. They don't want to go too close. Hand dryer. Will you fit here? Yeah, you'll fit there. That, that's good. So we've got three sinks, three toilets, one hand dryer. That should do. And can I fit you? You can go there. Okay. Fire extinguisher. A bin anywhere? In the middle? No, it doesn't really look good in the middle. No room for a bin in the toilets. That's okay. Alright. Um, that should do. So we have another one, uh, item controls, rotate an item, uh, you can always rotate it using Z and X, oh, okay. Pick up an item, yep, we've done that, okay, hospital reputation, increases each patient, yes, we know that, so, yeah, we're kind of running along, the doctor's getting a drink. Further diagnosis, uh, we're hearing some reports new in this is in town, these might be harder to diagnose, we may need to build a new diagnosis room, if a GP isn't certain they'll send a patient for further diagnosis, okay, general diagnosis, so we can put that, is it a 3x3, three three? yes, so we can have the door opposite there, again, I want to try and get them as close as possible to the door to minimize walking in because if it gets busy those few seconds will make a difference um, those are there filing cabinet we should add a filing cabinet don't think it'll make much of a difference I'll put a bin in there and a fire extinguisher um, maybe add a plant Put a plant here in the hallway. Medicine cabinet. That was the one, wasn't it? So we get diagnosis power, treatment power. So if we can add these into a room, we get a bit more diagnosis. What a smashing and when fails, a of doesn't do anything. I mean, who doesn't like gardening? Big bin. Digging up a bit of soil. Increases hygiene. A bit of reduces the oh, I can almost smell it now. Nope. Wait, this is one things that actually do again. stuff. Um, <laughs> no, my mistake. Anyway, keep those fingers green. Hmm. So it seems a medicine cabinet is the only thing that actually does something, apart from being decorative. Training speed. Okay. Those are handy. Um. We'll look into those later, so, I mean, if we can... I, I think we should save up for this one, for diagnosis and treatment power, and then we'll 
like put them in these rooms that are doing diagnosis and treatment. Um, do you want to stop editing this room? Um, no, we want it. I forgot. Okay, uh, we'll put some benches down so we have. little waiting area something like that so some people can wait there seems we've got quite a queue um, should we hire someone for the yes we need we need a nurse is it a nurse so these people are waiting for this room I guess uh, no. Treatment, pharmacy management. Hmm, I don't have anyone who's good at diagnosis. We'll get you, because you're the better nurse. Are you good at diagnosis? No, not really. So we won't get any diagnosis boosts really, I mean, when they come in, they'll go straight here, so they're close. Let's you see if they had to walk to the other side of the room, it would take longer. So we should get a hover over, so we've got a diagnosis 22% um, on them, so they're a bit more, like, more diagnosed now. Newsflash, there's a peculiar new illness in town, lightheadedness. We're going to need some expensive new equipment to deal with this. Continue expanding the hospital to unlock the treatment room. Also need another GP's office of staff to keep on top of things. Yes, that's what I was thinking. Things are getting a little bit busy. Um, so, hi to nurses, hi to doctors, build another GP's office. So that's what this room here is going to be. Another... GP's office. So we'll do it pretty much um, mirror image of what we had. Something like that. Um, we'll put a plant there and there. Fire extinguisher would be handy. That will do for now. And we'll hire another doctor. Uh, general practice. Diagnosis skills 15%, 10%. So I think we better get you. And then we can get a couple more benches so we can um, another bin okay so now we need to get a ward apparently so we can put the ward down on this side so uh, okay ward require get patient to wait Misery guts. Okay, let's uh, let's pause the game while we build while while we build the ward. Something like that. We'll put the door it has to be there. The nurse can go there. There should be a changing screen. Something like that. Okay. Uh, I mean, it's not like the best placement of beds, but maybe we can do something more like that. The 
that down. Let's see, I want to try and fit as many beds in as possible, so it'll be a bit ziggy taggy, but that should be okay. Um, the locker. Put a couple of lockers in. Filing cabinet for the nurse. Bin. Might be handy. Fire extinguisher, of course. Uh, under the window and a plant will fit nicely there. That should do. Oh, if we add like one more thing, we might up the room in prestige. Yes, it's become a nicer room. Okay, so we did that. Um, and we need to hire another nurse. So you are bedside manor. Yeah, we'll, we'll hire you. Okay, so that's... Go now. Wards could be good use for diagnosis and also treat a range of illnesses. A nurse is required to admit each patient, look after them and discharge them when they're ready to leave. Add multiple beds to a ward to deal with more than one patient at a time. You can also adjust the number of nurses that should work in the, in the room settings. This is useful if you have lots of patients. Right, we only have a small ward for now, but um, that will be handy later on. And I didn't read that, I just clicked it without reading. Um, Oh, the K is Kudosh. Okay, by doing cure three patients with lightheadedness. Okay. Uh, let's get. I'm pressing R. I'm used to pressing R for that. We'll get a chair there. Um, so, lightheadedness, we can probably add that here. Will it fit? Yes, it will fit nicely. Um, again, as close to the door as possible. And we'll rotate that. Something like that. That will do. Uh, an extinguisher. There. We'll add the plant in the back. That should do. That'll do for now. At least it will be operating. So, uh, yeah. Oh, you must have lightheadedness. And you do. Okay, but a lot of people are lightheadedness. And so, uh, is the doctor going to go? Yeah, the same doctor's going to go in and, and do lightheadedness. Okay. So let's uh, make this little area a little bit nicer. We could add a stack machine there as well, at the end of the hallway. Maybe an extinguisher. Right in the end, it's fine. Some benches. I wish they would auto rotate like the extinguishers. Don't quite want to go there, do you? That's okay. That'll do. What's that? We have more messages. So, patient death. Sad news, I face we had someone die. Hmm. Uh, so yeah, they can come back as a ghost. Uh, lightheadedness discovered. Yeah, we know about that. Okay. So it must have been someone with lightheadedness who died. I didn't actually see that. I was busy putting chairs. Um, right, let's watch. 
Okay, you got cured. Ooh, this needs maintenance. Are you able to do maintenance? Yes, you can. Okay. Yeah, these machines in the old game used to need maintenance a lot as well. So, uh, yeah, I think we could probably do with another doctor at this point. Uh, you good at diagnosis, so I'll hire you. Dump you there. Please don't unplug any vital hospital equipment. And it seems our receptionist is not around. Are you having a break? You're on a break. You're energized. You're on a break for nine days. Do we have a queue here? We have one person waiting. Uh, okay, on a seven day break now, six days. Okay, you don't take too long then. Uh, when you come back, you're gonna have a bit of a queue, Felix. We might want to uh, double up on the assistance then for that reason, but I think you've finished with your break now. Two more days. All right. Cured. Okay, you're cured. I don't want people leaving because they're waiting too long. Uh, Alright, so far you're not too bad. Okay, he's back. And he'll... He'll do that. Um, okay, you needed the toilet. They should manage. So what do we have next? I guess we just have to cure three people and um, cure two of the three. So you're going to go for more diagnosis. So you're you're our person. It's like um, you're going to go straight in. It's like the doctor took one look at you. Yep, you got lightheadedness. It's a bit obvious. Go and get go and get um, go and get. Your light bulb removed. Let's have a look at this. It's a bit violent. What's actually? Is it 3D printing? Uh -huh. Pop. There you go. Yeah. Um, we're a one-star hospital. Congratulations! Your hospital has been awarded a one-star rating. That's one out of a possible three. By the Two Point Health Ministry, I have retrieved your file from my bin to celebrate. Thanks for putting it in your bin. Continue to develop, de de continue to develop your enterprise in Hogsport for further esteem and trinkets if you believe that you are capable of more. Alternatively, run before you can walk and begin to expand your organisation by opening a new hospital in Lower Bollocks. Hmm. The choice is, as they say, is yours. Okay, we could do that. Um, I think we'll do that in the next episode because we've been going on for quite some time. So yeah, I think the next episode we'll start with bollocks, which I'm gonna, it's written right there. Okay, thanks a lot and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.